there are certain clinical predictor scores that are developed to diagnose NASH. The most important of all these scores is the Mayo Clinic score for NASH. This will be discussed in the subsequent slide. There are two other indices called the hair index and the bat index. What is hair index? Hair stands for H hypertension A ALT means SGPT more than 40 units I insulin resistance IR. So, hair is hypertension increased alanine transferase or the SGPT and insulin resistance. This score is used if two or more of these factors are present, they are 80 percent sensitive for the diagnosis of NASH and 89 percent specific for NASH. If they are present, 89 percent diagnostic certainty, if they are absent, 89 percent diagnostic certainty that there is no NASH. The other index is the BAT index, B for BMI more than 28. A for age more than 50, the another A, A for ALT more than two times the normal value of SGPT and T for the triglycerides. So, if you look at BMI, age, ALT and triglycerides and combine them into an index, le one or less than one has 100 percent negative predictive value for NASH. That means, if the patient has got at one or none of these factors like increased BMI, increased age or increased ALT or triglycerides, his chances of having NASH are 100 percent negative. If he has got more than one, then of course, we come into the investigation and evaluation for NASH. So, these are two simple indices based on common information that we can obtain from the patient such as BMI, age, SGPT and triglycerides. Of course, the Mayo Skilling score is more comprehensive which we will see in the next slide. This is the most comprehensive clinical score developed in 2008 for NASH. Six parameters are included in this particular development of the score age in years, BMI cages per meter square, impaired fasting glucose or diabetes mellitus, S or no, SGOT by SGPT ratio, platelet count in 10 to the power of 9 per liter and then serum globulin, sorry serum albumin in grams per cent. So, these six factors are used to construct a score. How the calculation is done? is given here a constant of minus 1.675 we use and then we multiply the age with 0 0.037 and then BMI 0 0.094 times and 1.13 times of either yes or no for diabetes, yes means 1, no means 0. The SGOT SGPT ratio is multiplied by 0.99 and platelet count in 10 to the power of 9 per liter is multiplied by 0 0.13 and then albumin value in grams per cent is multiplied by 0 0.66. So, when you have these values this plus this one plus this one plus this one minus these two minus these two will result in the score and that score will be interpreted. The interpretation is shown in the next slide. So, after going through the above calculation, if the result or the answer for that score is minus 1.455 or less, then there is no fibrosis or NASH in the liver. If the value is between 1.456 and plus 0.676, there is a high probability of NASH. And if the score value is more than plus 0 0.676, the diagnosis of NASH is definite. What is the use of the score? 
this score almost replaces liver biopsy to diagnose NASH. If we have this scoring, we can with certainty say that the patient has NASH or does not have NASH in majority of the cases depending on the score. And the score is also very simple to calculate because we use parameters which are very common, uh, commonly obtained from the patient like age, the BMI plus or minus of diabetes and then the SGOT, SGPT levels and then the ratio of them and of course the serum albumin is another factor which is included. So using these six factors which we have seen in the previous slide, this NASH score is obtained. And now we also have uh, this particular uh, paper presented in the Journal of Hepatology volume 45 number 4 in the year 2007 between these pages by Paul Angelio et al. So this is a summary score which I think all of us can start using and there is a small program which is uh, in excel format if you just put the numbers of the six parameters you do not have to go through the maths of working the score and the score and predictive value and the predictive answer like yes or no NASH or probable NASH uh, will be given by the small program which you can download from my website.